Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. So in this tutorial, we will teach you about using middleware to check user device environment and passing data from middleware to mutation. All right, so let's get started. So we have set up our basic NestJS application with registered GraphQL module and a basic resolver. The resolver contains a simple mutation called hello world. The mutation will pick up request ID from the context and print it alongside with hello world. We have also created a utility function that which will take request object and check if the request is made from mobile environment. If you have been working with NestJS and GraphQL for a while, you would know that we cannot use NestJS middleware with GraphQL. So to create a middleware, we will be using cards as our middleware function. The cards in NestJS is used to protect resources based on certain criteria. A card can return true if we want to pass the request forward or otherwise we can if we, if we return false if we don't want request to move forward. So first of all, we will generate a card file called check mobile environment card. To do so, we will head over to the terminal and enter We'll move these files to cards folder. And update the index file. As we want to check for mobile environment, we will pick up request object from context and use the utility function to check if the request is from mobile environment. In the first line, we are creating a GraphQL context which contains the data related to current request. Then we are using GraphQL context object to access request object and store it in request constant. Then we are passing this request object to our utility function which returns true or false based on user agent. Now if the request is from mobile, then we return true otherwise we will it will result into an, an exception great work now we will generate a request id and attach that to our request code text to generate request id we will be using a package called uuid so let's do it First of all, we will be importing UUID uh, from UUID package and then we will be using uh, UUID library to generate a request ID and then attach it to requested params. Then we, we are accessing this custom property from our hello world mutation. Now that our middleware functionality is complete, we will use this with our hello world mutation. To use middleware, we will use useGuard decorator and pass it class name of our custom middleware. Our code is ready. Let's test it with GraphQL Playground. So we are now in our GraphQL Playground. We have added the script to call our hello world mutation. Now, if I we try to run it, it should throw a mobile environment error. To let our request move forward, we need to change our browser user agent to any mobile user agent. 
To change our user agent to Android, we will head to our user agent change extension and select Android. Now, if we run our request a few times, it would generate different request IDs. As you see, can see in the output, every time I click this button, it will generate a different request ID from the middleware and pass it to the uh, mutation. So as you have seen, we can use the power of Nest.js cards to use as middlewares. To use these cards globally, you can pass it to app.useGlobalCard function of Nest.js application object. If you have found this video valuable, please click subscribe button and hit bell icon so you can get notified about our upcoming videos.